Well, he better talk on it. But Jaden and Chase, they have to make the fans them know what really are going on. Yeah, man, now, move settings nation. And now, we don't need no ladder. Now, welcome to the channel. Yeah, man, now, Jaden and Chase, and I want to wake up with another important reasoning for the topic of dancehall and entertainment. Mm -hmm. Remember, man, I'm here I don't know, but click the subscribe icon, then the bell icon, and also the like, the comment, and yes, what's a shape on the blogging shoot. Will Jada Kingdom lose it all from one post? No version subscribers, dance all star Jada Kingdom, yes, it is true. She is facing a multi million dollar defamation lawsuit from her management company, Pop Style Music. And, and I guess this group is also responsible for her manager and also her publishing. Now this particular lawsuit was filed in the Supreme Court in connection with the social media rant by the entertainer. But those not in the know, I don't remember which rant at first, I'll take a quick look on the statements made by her and they will continue reason. Look and listen. We're going crazy. But for now, I just deal with everything the right fucking way. Looking for new management, new team, new every fucking body. This is fucking trash. Don't make no fucking sense. I don't want a body to come into my life, come linger, linger around my career, and I put my, I take my thing for. Yes, no version subscribers. Attorney representing pop style music, Randall Young says, Kingdom went on her social media platform and knowingly made false allegations, which suggested that her manager and management team were dishonorable in their financial dealings with her. And as a record label, that's something big, or even as a management company. Because remember, their primary means of income is managing other artists, especially whether it be established or young artists who are followed up in the industry. So to hear an artist that was once managed by a certain company followed out to the public and make certain statements, of course, it damages reputation. But if them do it, them do it. No. According to the legal team for pop style music publishing, at the time when she made the video to her fan base on social media, Kingdom knew that the claims she made are damaging and false. But here is where it gets interesting. Kingdom is being asked to pay general damages, interest and damages, and to issue an apology to her management team and its principal, the pop style music and publishings now it might be simple as stating general damages and interest and damages as simple as that might sound that can be millions to hundreds of millions depending on what the label states because they can say many lucrative deals were in the chain and in the pipeline and because of statements made by jada they subsequently lost out on those deals and that could be a deal them could have said it worth 100 million 200 million she already has said based upon the amount of money what them take from her and the royalties they may she said i go to them where will she now find that money for pay them them so-called millions of dollars that they might lose based on the one statement that she made and truth be told, she was asked what I want. And she chose to tell the people. She frustrated. As they say, she alone the woman. She's off the island. So she got to talk to the people who she feel like they care about her. She had to talk about her career. So she said talk to it, talk about it with her fans. Them start for ask a couple questions. She chose to answer them. It was not just a complete social media run. She never found out and just talked straight about them. She had talked about her career, what she feel like she had to do going forward. It was a whole reasoning. It wasn't specifically about them. No, they might talk about the particulars. The parts of the conversation where she did mention them. And yes, she did say them rub up her money. And that's what she feel. She feel like them rub up her money. I think she will be filing a count. I think either she filed already or will be filing a counter lawsuit. You know what I mean? Because she has them going millions of fair dollars and now they want her to pay back millions again. If she wins her lawsuit, it would be the other way around. Them would definitely have a pay she. If she wins though. If them win them case. 
then she can have to pay them. As long as, remember, it is no a matter for the court to decide. So if the court should rule in their favor, as long as, you know what I mean, she's alive and well, she will have to find some way to pay them. Now in a statement by Kingdom's manager, he said, for the, over the past four years, he has done nothing but believe in the artist and supported her, whether on an emotional, financial or a professional level. Kingdom's manager says, he invested significant sums of money into her career and personal well-being. And this is something she always forward upon the media and I talk about as well. So then definitely like I use her own statements to prove the truth of his statements. And he says the deal that Jada was given is standard. He said it is normal in the music industry. The management agreement between Kingdom and the team permits him to recoup his investment against her future earnings. So whichever money she makes in the future. And while it might be in a sound away, it is definitely industry policy. Not that you have a sign to it, but it's a contract of people who try to bring to you. Sometimes you need a lawyer to negotiate for say no, this is not gonna work or this is gonna be the way. And he also went as far as to say to date his investment in her remains substantially unrecouped. So him basically I say up to this point, no matter how much song I hear Jada upon her, how it big the, the hit was to you, him not get back the money where him invest into making the song a hit. You no know, no. Definitely no. You make a hear about some more what she had to say. We will continue the reason again. Tell the manager for go and do your own thing yourself. You know what I'm can't do it right now. No rush it. Every, everything have a time. I mean, nobody have a question, a career man, a question, a thing like, oh, like maybe, maybe I'm not good. Or maybe I just, you understand? Everybody has talk about, oh, oh, you know, oh, you know, they are so old, this, old, that. Fuck up manager like them with them fuck up relationships and them bridges with them burn out everything come fuck up everything and fuck up your brand like that's not the thing and that's not what we're going for like 2021 is a bigger bag bigger level like bigger everything 2021 new team new management new everything 2021 going all the fucking way up 2021 and then fuck with nobody a very fuck up so right now but they find a different Thing, as you can see, but that's a good thing in the world. Me's not a girl really show and tell, but look like I got money for start for people system, I mean fucking business. So, I'm gonna start vlog my life. I'm gonna understand. And yeah, I'm working on a new album. It's, it's basically finished, but I have to wait till certain business clear up because guys barely see dollar from my music barely see shit barely fucking barely be a fucking thief out there scammer out there no one see a reason why no one you no one you fucking happy in your own circle it fuck up trust me I saw everybody like I'm just I go crazy. I'm going crazy. Trust me, I'm going fucking crazy. Careful who you have in a circle, people. Like careful, careful who you let in a circle. Careful who you who. We are called family and day ones. Them no fucking rate you. Them don't fucking rate you. A producer will fuck me over and the one person was supposed to be in a corner as management, them are fucking over. It's just too much bullshit. Which mall? DM me. If you're in LA, DM me. I tell you which mall I will link up. Females only. I don't want a man comes to me.
The man vice is the one called Jaden Chase, the dancehall correspondent, the Gaza representative, and reminded them now if you're new to the channel, new to the movement, just a pass through. But you like the reason, and of course, you like the point of view. Well, I'm suggesting to you that you click the subscribe icon and then the bell icon right after that and put it on all. And this is how you know you'll be notified of all fresh content as soon as fresh content is uploaded and made available for you right here upon the platform you may now move settings from and now when they need no ladder and my sentiments for you and yours is of course when they live love and prosper until we reason again yes young artists contact the ig page jaden underscore chase underscore for details about the review so i hope a message of forwarding but you know what i mean for specific details from that when they message tell we say the review you want to you know what i mean so until the reason again as i said before live love and prosper